So guys, I am back with another Dying Light 2 video and today I'm just going to showcase to you a weapon which you will all eventually get if you do follow the path of the main story. Uh, it's actually quite early on. It is what, well, I've, I've looted, I've spent hours farming this and the other and I've never actually found a rare weapon. I mean, I could buy one maybe from one of the many vendors I've come across. I could probably craft one, but actually in terms of getting one for free, finding one, I haven't so far. But eventually, well, eventually, it's actually pretty early on. You'll work for a guy called Ator. He's a peacekeeper's main dude. He does that on this big old dirty military basic kind of thing here. And he sends you out looking for a basically brass knuckles called the Lazarus. It's actually a nice shaped car. Um, once you actually, I ain't going to ruin the story or nothing like that, but you eventually get them. Uh, when you take them back to him, he actually gives you this weapon right here. Now, I've actually dropped a little bit of a modification on it because it's how we roll. I added the only thing I could add to it, which was a little bit of a spark. I'm running around thinking I'm four here. Um, but yeah, pretty cool. I'm just going to actually just find the zombie and just whack him with it and see what happens. But obviously, it's early days. For me, you probably watched this, you haven't even got the game yet. Uh, but there's so much you can do in this game, guys. It's unbelievable. Oh, shit. Did not mean to throw a throwing knife. Badooken. Badooken. He's all that. Like I'm saying, level one enemies. Like, he's such a low level at the minute. But this is actually quite powerful. And in terms of its durability, it's amazing. This is what I need. All my weapons I've had. I mean, 15, 20 hits, and they are just done. I mean, a lot of my weapons I've just found on rooftops and stuff because there are quite a few of them up there, but they're all just a weak, common crap. I mean, I've got quite a few here. Like this one here. I mean, you'll see. I'll put this on. It just burns out so fast. Who are you? Who's the you knocking on like that? I mean, if you look at the bar, bottom left corner of the screen, you can see that this thing just... I mean, it's just durability is just not an existent. It, it's done. Oh, I'm trying to swing. I've got no stamina. I was wondering what was going on there. Come on. I'll do you over, my Fuck, don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. Nanny's got nothing. What? Tight ass zombies. Someone's got a. What the? Ow, ow. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, 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 what happened there, boy? What happened there, boy? Did I get your throat? Hmm? I'll chop your ass up while you're down. So I'm saying this weapon's a beast. It is an absolute beast. And it is, like I said, the first rare one you will legitimately come across unless someone finds a blueprint. To, well, if you find a blueprint to one, I doubt you'll be able to craft it with materials you'll find this early on. Um, but here it is. here's the baby. It's called the Chopper, the rare one H axe, and durability is quite good. Uh, but yeah, there we have it, people. There we have it. Actually, what's that saying? Let's look at this. Charm slap. Okay, so I can add this to it. Inhibitors pack. Hmm. No, why not? Let's just put this on. Let's just put this on. Why not? I think I've got unlimited ones of them, to be honest. I think I can um, put on as many weapons as I want. Let's bring it out. Hey, you can see it just hanging on there. <laughs> Come, you're coming up here. Come on. Come on. Talking to me, boy. I'll chop your ass up. Ho! Ho, ho, ho! Yeah. Yeah. That's what his weapon just disappeared. Could have done with that for a spare. Could have done with that for a spare. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, people? Ha! Ah, boom! You know how many times I've killed myself with them? Do you know how many times I've killed myself with them? <laughs> Let's search the bins. What we're gonna get here? It's pure scrap. I hear zombies. Hop up! Pop up, pop up, bitch! Off with your arms! Boom! Off with your other arm! <laughs> yeah, 
Yes. But yeah, guys, like I said, this is the first rare weapon you actually come uh, you come across against Aitor. I don't know if you pronounce his name. It's A I T O R. The main dude of the peacekeepers, either way. And like I said, when you're taking back the Lazarus, which are the brass knuckles, he rewards you with these uh, or with this weapon. So yes, make the most of it, guys. It's quite good. It's quite decent. Uh, so yes. And it is a simple, short but sweet video, guys. I thought I'd just showcase this with you. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one.